What's up guys, it's your boy NCSO7 here doing a brand new playthrough. Today I'm going to be playing, doing a new playthrough on Super Monkey Ball Banana Plus HD. So, let's get this started. We're going to do the main game. And start this off. So anyways, if you guys want to see more Monkey Ball content from me, then make sure to like and subscribe. I was just trying to listen, <laughs> make sure. But it, yeah, if you guys want to see more Monkey Ball content, then make sure to like and subscribe if you guys want to. And yeah, I'm going to be playing through this game. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to tr actually try and get through all 10 worlds, which shouldn't be a problem until like the very last world. We all know how to play this. Okay, not really. Also, I'm playing the version on Nintendo Switch, if anyone was wondering, so... Easy. Yeah. You might be wondering why I'm playing this game and not, like, the original Monkey Ball in the GameCube or something like that, but honestly, it's just because, I don't know... I just felt like doing this one, but maybe if you guys do want me to do try and do some videos on the original Monkey Ball games, then let me know in the comment section because I will gladly do that stuff on potential streams and whatnot. Not too hard. Honestly, the first like, honestly, nothing's gonna get really hard until like maybe the ninth world because. If you do hear any background noise, I am sorry because I don't live by myself. <laughs> Alright, let's see if I can do the entirety of this. God damn. God damn it, I already missed two of them. Yeah, if you do hear anything in the background, I'm s sorry about that. Wow, what is with the... Okay, only a few more. This isn't hard at all, but... Alright. So I guess may as well talk about some videos that are going to be coming out soon, so... Uh, well, first of all, I'm going to be posting the next part of Monkey Ball Banana Blitz HD tomorrow, so... Do be sure to check out... Be on the lookout for that. Um, and then Friday, I'm going to be doing my Luigi's Mansion 3 re-review, mainly because it's not that I wasn't satisfied with my original Luigi's Mansion 3 review, which, if you haven't seen my original review of Luigi's Mansion 3, I highly recommend checking it out. It's in my NCS07 episodes playlist. Um, but it's the simple fact that I want to redo my review because I played through the game nine times by this point. At this point in time, so I want to, and I want to make it much more constructive. Whoa! I swear to God, if I actually die in this world, that'd be embarrassing. But I want to make a more constructive review. I want to actually have a script. I want to make sure I talk about everything I can, and really get my opinion across about what of what I think about the game and some of the more controversial quirks and all that jazz so that'll be happening Friday Saturday I'm going to be doing another live stream I'm not sure what I'm gonna be live streaming I'm probably gonna be live streaming myself playing a game as opposed to a DDLC stream because um, next Sunday is when I'm gonna be posting a brand new DDLC mod and that's gonna be on um, act 9 of series a special one and it's going to be a much more spoilery video so I'm not going to 
stream myself making it so that way spoilers don't get out there. So, yeah, I'm not sure. I'll probably just play a game, and of course, Sunday will have a new DDLC mod. This boss isn't hard at all. If there weren't guardrails, then this wouldn't be difficult. Like, it really wouldn't... Oh, no. Get it! Get it! Great job! Jeez, you completely missed your point. Okay, we got another chance. For some reason, there's some sort of weird jumping glitch where... Sometimes my jump just doesn't execute for some reason. E clearly not enough went into this game when testing. Okay, I almost fell out there. Get it! What are you doing? Wow, my steering is really bad. Okay. That didn't even do anything. Why are you missing so much? Wow, I was missing everything. Alrighty, the first one is, go is ours, and now it's time to go on to the next world. And we also got a champion medal, which is very sexy. Sorry, it's very sexy. Anyways... One, th one thing I'm really hoping that they do is they just make... Like, I hope they can... Okay, that was really bad idea. I was gonna try and use a shortcut. Oh! And, and it makes it worse because I'm actually streaming this game over to my PC, so it's even harder to get my movements exactly. There we go. Nice. We have plenty of lives though. We shouldn't be getting to continue. To be honest, and this video might be content kind of short considering I'm going to be ending this part after this world. But honestly speaking, I I could honestly do the whole. Mm, how did I miss that? The game's acting really weird. I guess. I could do it in like one video in like two hours, but I don't know. I want to kind of split it off into more parts. I don't want it to be too short. Like my Cuphead playthrough was, because I did a Cuphead playthrough way back when, and that playthrough was so short, I, I want to make a few more parts. Screw up. Wouldn't be so bad if everything was del nothing was delayed. Okay, I'm not going for that anymore. That's just not worth it. I I've already wasted more. Wow, streaming it over is a really bad idea when it comes to this sort of game because it makes platforming really hard. Right. This stage isn't hard either, so. Why? Why are you acting so weird? Jeez, it feels like lately I've been having a really crappy job of steering these things. Wow, my monkey is like completely losing all of its... 
Jeez. This is ridiculous. Ready? I know I'm gonna miss one at the very least. Yep, I was exactly right. Of course. The problem is that the steering is so weird. Come on, get better steering. We have time, but still doesn't make it less annoying. Yeah, if you do hear anything in the background, I am terribly sorry. I don't live in a house of my own, unfortunately. Sweet. Stay straight. Wow. Honestly, I don't know why. Sega decided to remake this game. They could have remade one of the original Monkey Ball games and instead they had to remake this garbage. Actually, I'm completely kidding on that. Banana Blitz really isn't that bad. I and, and it is biased. This was one of the first... Banana Blitz was one of the first games I've ever played, so... It is kind of biased, but seriously, Banana Blitz isn't that bad. It definitely isn't nearly as good as the... Previous, like, the Monkey Ball games on GameCube, but it's not that bad. Like, some people really miss that completely. Some people really make it seem like this game's the devil. I mean, this game did definitely start the decline in the Monkey Ball series, but it's not that bad. Did I just glitch myself? This right here shows you how much time Sega put into this game. Wow. At least they give you so much time. Okay, I'm gonna give this a shot. Ugh! The freaking leg! It's not coming from the game itself. It's just when I... Because I stream it, it makes it way harder to even play the game. There we go. Whew. That wasn't so bad. Alrighty. Last stage. Alright, the All right. after this stage is the boss of this world, and oh boy, do I not like it. <coughs> what the hell was that? That makes no sense at all. How did I die? This game was definitely not tested enough. I don't even understand what I did wrong. I did what? This game was clearly not tested nearly enough. They barely even tested this game out. How am I dying? I did this the first time easily. Okay, that was not a good move on my part. Oh my goodness. What is with... Seriously, I really wish Sega would put more time into this game. They really... This game is so unpolished. Like... It isn't terrible, but it's so unpolished. I can tell they weren't testing this thing nearly enough when making the game. They put this game together really quickly just to get some money. And then they're making people buy the game so that way we might have any, even have a chance to get the other Monkey Ball games. So that's just great. 
literally just chibi robo zip lash all over again making consumers buy something that they don't want to get so that way their series can still stay alive that's good news to be fair though amusement vision doesn't develop the games anymore so it isn't I really want one of these things to come at me. That did it. Whoa! C stay still! Oh my god! D great job! Okay, I'm not even gonna get that because that's not even necessary. I really, really, really hate this boss. I'm gonna go for those bananas. Too much time on my hands. Why does he fall down like that? Seriously, the. Oh! Come on! This boss really isn't hard. I swear, I don't know why I'm doing bad with it now. Really? That was enough to push me? Fair in so many ways. I this really makes me wish that Sega put more effort into this game. And again, it is Sega, so Jeez, this game was not tested at all. They didn't even try it with this game. They literally made a worse version of Banana Blitz. I'm not even kidding. This is even less polished than the original game was. If I'll be completely honest, it's worse. But of course I'm going to play it more because it's on the Switch. The original game, this wasn't that difficult. But yeah, in this game, they are just so weird. They move so weirdly. I don't know why this is so difficult. This really isn't hard. I could do this in the original game easy peasy. It's because he has to keep taking his time to get himself comfortable. Look at how bad that animation is. Seriously, I've made better animations than that myself, and I'm only one person. Quit taking your time! You're taking... Great, now I gotta wait... Wow, I'm already starting to get angry, and this is only the second world. Seriously, it's like, why didn't you put any time into this game? This game... It did less than the... I don't know. I honestly, I don't even know if I want to see remakes of the original two games at all. Because if they're just handled by Sega, then they're just going to ruin it again. Considering this is what they did. That. Why can't.
There we go. Jeez, that was way harder than it needed to be. Ooh, it feels so good! Alrighty. Thank God. I don't know why I died so many times. Well, anyways, thank you guys for watching the first part. Make sure to like and subscribe if you guys wanted to see some more Monkey Ball content. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out. Take care.